This is part three of the ultimate guide to London's Chinatown. We're just outside Chinatown at Hoban, but trust me, it's worth the walk. We've come to Happy Lamb, which is a fantastic choice if you want hot pot in London. It's really interactive. You get these two broths, you get these wonderful ingredients, you cook them yourself. We've got fish, prawns, seafood, lamb, beef. Wonderful, wonderful ingredients. Let's go and see what it's like. food has arrived. We've got the two broths, so we've got a super spicy chicken marrow broth and then a normally spicy like non-spicy uh, chicken marrow broth as well just to balance it out. The toppings are amazing. We've got some really thinly sliced lamb, some thinly sliced beef sirloin, we've got kimchi, we've got some bassa, some fish, a huge amount of chili, we've got a load of dried chilies, a load of fresh chilies, coriander, all the sauces, it's gonna be amazing. Let's dig in. Oh yeah, if you had egg balls then, it's good, it's perfect. Really and she's come to a hot pot restaurant. It's amazing, isn't it? I just love it. So I love how interactive it is. It's been my whole life. Okay, time to try our first bit of cooking. Thinly sliced lamb. What broth do I want? Spicy or not spicy? Um, okay, we're going for spicy. Like beautiful, rare, rare lamb, really, really thinly spiced, going straight in that spicy broth. Wow, that cooks so quickly in that beautiful broth. We've gone for the super spicy one, just laced with chilies, and look at that. That was just a few seconds in there, just perfectly cooked. <laughs> wow. Oh, that broth is really spicy. It's just full of chilies floating around in there. The lamb is so, so tender. That's delicious. We've got some grilled lamb. Beautiful, look. It's just, it's just super, super crispy on the outside, really soft on the inside. Mmm. Amazing. <laughs> Huge flavor, wow. The chili powder just running all over it and that really, really rich lamb fat, okay. that's so good. Okay, I'm gonna make up a whole bowl now, just a little selection of different things. So we got some, some simple white rice to start with. Mm. Yeah. Some herbs, There's some coriander, a bit of spring onion. Let's go for some kimchi as well. Yeah. Mm. What's the fish like? A little bit of fresh chili yeah, as well. Oh, look, the noodles here. A little bit of that spicy, spicy broth all over the top. Right, let's try this little bowl of rice, super spicy broth, some kimchi, all the herbs. Let's give it a go. Mm. How long did you cook that for? It's looking Mike? so good. Mm. Oh, wow. Mm. Oh, the kimchi is such a good flavor. Because it's like a, a, a ready cold side dish. It's just such a nice change of temperature, change of texture, and the flavor is just, oh, it cuts straight through the spicy, sort of rich flavor of the broth. It's cold, it's fermented, bang. Oh, just brings it to another level, it's a great dish. Wow. 
This is judging by some fact. It's pretty awesome, isn't it? New. There are whole garlic cloves in the spicy broth. Look at that. In mean, what other cuisine would you just get a broth full of entire garlic cloves? Let's give that a try. Oh. Wow. That's a real whack in the face full of garlic flavour. Hey Mike, you absolutely filled your bowl with chilli. How's that going down? You know what? There's a lot of restaurants who would have fucked you up like this. This restaurant has, and I'm very pleased with them for it. That is actually genuinely very spicy. Uh, we asked for four of these, and then I'll give them four fresh chilli, and then four of the uh, dried sort of, sort of like oily chilli. What are you going to do with And it's fucked me up, and I couldn't be happier. So fucking thumbs up to this place. <laughs> They've got these amazing hand-cut noodles. In the kitchen they're sink. covered in flour, they're straight out of the kitchen, handmade, hand-rolled, beautiful. We're going to try them with some really, really garlicky soy sauce. Let's give it a go. We threw up in the sink with all the plate pots and pans in. <laughs> and then passed out. Oh, wow. The sesame oil in there is going to be amazing. That soy sauce caked in sesame oil and the chopped fresh garlic just boost those noodles to another level they're amazing oh. how are those spicy noodles treating you mate i'm not quite like, <laughs> i'm not quite like it's, it's, it's special but like, oh, that, yeah, that, yeah. Like, that, like. actually yeah one side of your face is very sweaty and the other side is okay it's not sweat it's tears <laughs> it's, done, it's, done. Yeah, it's definitely done now it's definitely done now yeah doesn't take long. It's time for a bit of beef. Yeah. That beef just cooks in seconds. I mean, literally 20 seconds in there. It's a perfectly, perfectly cooked piece of beef. I mean, look at that. You know, the, the best thing about Hot Pot really is how interactive it is. You're cooking your own food and you get all these beautiful dishes. You get these two amazing broths. You get the herbs, you get the dips. It's just, it's so much fun. You're not just sitting there and eating a meal that somebody's brought you. You're creating your own meal and it's so much fun. Oh, thanks, man. Yeah. Thank you. Luke, this is your first hot pot. What do you reckon, man? Yeah, it's good. It's more than I was expecting it to be, to yeah. be honest. <laughs> it's spicy. We've gone for a spicy one. But, um, yeah, you. I almost felt like you could eat 100 bowls when I came in, but when you get in, you can't eat 100 bowls. Yeah. I feel a bit sick right now. <laughs> it's rich, it's spicy, it's, uh, it's just wonderful. Yeah, it, it fills you up quick. Good. As we've been eating, we've slowly been dropping things into the different broths. So we've been dropping the beef, the lamb, the fish, and the tofu, the vegetables. It's just so exciting when you, you dive in there. You don't know what to expect. And you just, you produce this perfectly cooked piece of meat or the vegetable. It's just, I love making my own food. It's just the most creative, creative way of eating in a restaurant. Hot pot is such, such a fun thing to come and eat when you've got a group of people. You're all sitting around the table with a group of friends. You're all cooking. It's really, really good fun. If you're looking for a great hot pot near Chinatown, comes a happy lamb at Hoban. You really can't go wrong. It's fantastic. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed our video, please consider subscribing and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.